Among the drones that the US supplies to Ukraine in hundreds, a VBAT model has been discovered that is invulnerable to enemy radio interference. This is the development of the California startup Shield AI. The Wall Street Journal writes about this. Having tested the Californian UAVs and being impressed by their invulnerability to Russian jammers, Ukraine immediately requested 200 new units. One drone of this model costs about $1 million, but the wholesale price is significantly lower. VBAT is a reconnaissance drone that can also act as a bomber. It is special because it is powered by artificial intelligence technology and is capable of long-range flights. The UAV can independently maneuver over the battlefield, study it, and identify targets for strikes. It does not require a pilot or even a GPS system to do this. The VBAT platform is integrated with the HiveMind artificial intelligence system from Shield AI. This ensures its autonomy and the ability to make independent decisions in the field. AI allows the device to safely avoid obstacles and find optimal routes. The UAV can stay in the air without recharging for up to 12 hours, cover a distance of almost 1,000 kilometers while carrying about 11 kilograms of projectiles to drop on the target. Ukrainian specialists conducted very intensive tests of the Californian VBAT at their testing ground. They tried to suppress the drone with numerous electronic warfare systems used by the Russian army. None of the jammers had any effect on it. It continued to fly. The publication notes that the VBAT tests were also conducted near the front line. The drone flew almost 100 kilometers, entering the territory controlled by the Russian occupiers. It calmly flew over a zone that is inaccessible to most other UAVs, as it is tightly closed by Russian electronic warfare systems. The drone not only successfully completed the flight, but also detected an anti-aircraft missile system belonging to the occupiers. The Ukrainian armed forces took advantage of the opportunity and launched a missile strike on the Russian installation. The United States will send a new package of military aid to Ukraine worth $400 million. The Pentagon chief Lloyd Austin said on October 31st that the aid package would be announced in the coming days. Speaking at a press conference alongside U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken and their South Korean counterparts, Austin said that the aid package would include artillery, air defense, armored vehicles, ammunition, and other critical weapons. In particular, the aid package includes armored personnel carrier M113 ammunition to HIMARS multiple launch rocket system, 155mm and 105mm artillery shells, 60mm, 81mm and 120mm mortar systems and shells, Javelin anti-tank guided missile and AT-4, satellite communications equipment, ammunition, as well as logistics support. The new aid package also includes 211 striker fighting vehicles. The latest U.S. aid package to Ukraine was announced by Lloyd Austin on October 21. Earlier, President President Volodymyr Zelensky said the U.S. was preparing an additional $800 million package earmarked for drone production in Ukraine. The new U.S. military aid to Ukraine comes amid Russia's advances in eastern Donetsk region and Kremlin's claims about the capture of a number of villages and settlements in the region. It should be noted that Washington is the largest provider of military aid to Ukraine, with Washington supplying $64 billion in military assistance since Russia launched its full-scale invasion in February 2022.